Andrew. Yeah, good afternoon, Tom. I'm really looking forward to this one, Tom. Oh, it's massive. Oh, yes, it is massive. It's so massive. And the afternoons are lighter. And the afternoons are lighter. We're an hour earlier, Tom, today. Hello there. Good evening to you. Well, good afternoon. Good evening. Early evening. Good early evening to you. Welcome back to Ford over at Lover. It is fantastic to have you with us for what is hopefully another one of those famous classic nights under the lights. We got quite close to the 1500 light mark. We didn't quite reach it on Friday, I'm afraid. But we are going to go for 1500 tonight. We're going for 1500 plus likes. Don't mind how many more, Tom. Should also say subscribers getting very exciting. Wouldn't want anyone to miss a moment of Fauna written over it this month because it is exciting. Well, I'm really proud, Tom. It's been a really excellent season, hasn't it? We've had some great times and let's, let's celebrate the last six games in true Pompey passionate fashion. Come on, you blues. Outdoors here. I'm at Fram Park on a rainy day, playing derby, having the best time ever. We're top of the league, guys, and it's going to be all the way through, mate, all the way through. 4-0, oh, we're in all over it. beat me to it. 4-0, 4-0, got to be, hasn't it? They don't get much bigger than this, do they? They don't, no, and uh, as we said on Sunday, the fans will be up for it, because I think if the fans will get up for it, they take their mind off getting wet. And if you can keep Mendes Land quiet, I think we're in for a he's, he's League One's most dangerous winger at the moment. You know, all season he's, he's just produced with assists and everything else. So I think Rafferty coming in at right back makes sense. I can see the, the logic behind, behind Evans coming in to shore up that midfield. He come on against Wickham when we beat him 3 1, dominating that midfield with well. Moxon. I said on Sunday, I think we're going to nick it by a goal. I, I said 1 0. But I wouldn't be surprised with a one-all draw. Good evening, Tom. How excited are you for this? Oh, I'm so excited. I remember standing here before the Bolton game, before that 2-0, and I was saying, I'm actually confident and I'm excited. I'm not nervous and petrified. This Pompey side rises to the occasion time and time again. We've proven that we can do that time after time this season, and we're hoping that tonight's going to be a similar story. Six games to go. We're almost there. Everybody's riding with confidence here at Fratton Park. Everybody's in good spirits, and let's just get the job done. The last time I saw you said it was going to be three sets to love, didn't you, against That's in. That's right, you're a very good memory there. What, what are we, oh, thank you very much, Marcus. I very much appreciate that, good sir. Jake is from the fabulous Rams Talk podcast and has very kindly braved the elements to come and speak <laughs> to us this evening. For us, I mean, people have said it's a free hit. I don't think it is. But again, you know, we, it's a long way. You're top of the league. If we can get something, it's a bonus. If we don't get something, it's what we all expect. When I say win the next four games and Go That's up, even worse. That's champions. a nice bit of pathetic fallacy for you here yeah. on Fauna over. And the light's gone off as well. I'm not going to be a bit negative, not normally me, but 1-1. One, one. You know, we're very similar sides. We play, I'd probably say, pretty similar football as well. So I think it's going to be a really, really even game. We're getting soaked we are under getting an soaked. umbrella. Your umbrella. And, the, <laughs> and Reese is looking at me like, you're getting soaked, I'm getting soaked. Thank you, Jeffrey. Cheers, mate. Legend. <laughs> Oh, 
It's quite sweet and tasty. Enjoy some of it. Come on. Cheers, mate. Come on. Let's do it. Have a happy Cheers, man. Good man. Take care. It's a celeb now, isn't it? No. People come up and ask for photos of you. Oh, I think you're there, more yeah. describing yourself there, sir. No, I kept out of it. Did not know this. <laughs> Their second goal is the exact replica of the first one. Like we've not learned from the first one, and we've let them do it again. Same goal scorer, same play. We got back into it once, and it's disappointing to let them let them get ahead again. But they're attacking. They look fantastic. But so do we when we attack. We knew the game plan from Derby would be sitting, soak up Pompey, playing with the ball, and then catch us on the break. They've done that twice, and we're two on down. We need to improve second half, and hopefully at least get a draw out of this. What a game! Well happy with that Tom. I don't know if many noticed but you know Rafferty coming straight back in the side up against Blackett Taylor. The number of times that Kamara ran back on the overlap to support Rafferty where he'd gone forward you know the amount of unselfish running from him and then when his chance came to have the composure and the touch to finish it in the way that he did. His first half was just a pure class act. Christian Sadie <coughs> on the cusp of half time. <coughs> if that's on target if that's a Northampton as we were just saying just then maybe we're talking in if buts and maybes. It was a difficult game tonight in difficult conditions. I thought two sides went at it under the lights very well indeed. I thought they were very good against the ball first half and hit us with two one the strikes. Second half we managed the game really really well so 2-2 two is probably a fair result and uh, the best team in this league are top of the league quite rightly so and that's where we'll remain Tom. I want to talk to you about Owen Moxham. Oh my word. Pulled it out of the very top draw. We know we have that he has that in his locker and actually I think it was it was maybe something I said to you oh I look like Jedwood. It's going to prove that it's not just knitted on isn't it? This, this, I wish <laughs> I could look like Jedwood. One thing I've, I've said to the boys repeatedly the last couple of weeks is that a couple of times where Marlon or even Owen have uh, let fly from range and it hasn't quite gone to plan. It was only a matter of time I think before he did. Throughout that second half I was thinking there'll be one little moment, there'll be one little glimpse, one little opportunity that we get. If we take it and if we get it spot on we're going to equalise it. I didn't feel like working the box, working the ball, doing the Marlon pivot, doing the that endless kind of cycle of insanity that, that Pompey was seemingly getting themselves accustomed to in that second half. Was that going to make a goal or was it going to have to take a special moment of magic from Owen? We found out it was the latter. Agreed to a point, but let me just wind you back in. Go on, wind me in, my son. Go on. You've just answered your own question very succinctly. Matches are won in moments. Good teams find moments. We now have a squad full of players who have those moments of quality. Unlock those moments in the chaotic urban flow of a football match. Oh yeah, that's what you like the video for. <laughs> that unbeaten run, Dan, is getting frighteningly lengthy now, by the way. A buzzword that will come out of tonight is resilience from Pompey. Go behind in probably one of what wouldn't have been built maybe in the dressing room, but what the fans would have probably felt was one of our biggest games for nigh on a decade. Come back, go again, go and score the equaliser, get back in the game. Just go home, sleep well, people because it's happening. Cracking goal from Moxon, really enjoyed that. Great atmosphere, see you in the championship derby. Thank you very much, I think they probably will go up as well. Paul Warren's an excellent manager. We're gonna take a breath, the Pompey players are gonna take a breath. Take a breath at home as well. Big weekend coming your way. Shrewsbury here at Fratton Park, 4-0 Sunday live on the Sunday. And then after that, could be a handful of points that we need. Big night here at Fratton Park for big game players. What a game it was. Thank you for joining us all the way to the end. Until Saturday, keep the faith and as always, play out Pompey! Play out Pompey! Go south, leave the team down.